All right, I don't know if you guys can see this view, but that is the ocean. And a year ago, I was living with my parents and I think it's safe to say we've ascended. All right, we are in the pool. And let me tell you, life right now has started to feel a little bit like a dream, a little bit like a movie. Stuff starts to get surreal when you tap into a vision and then it just comes into your life like magic. It feels unreal and we all have this ability. In fact, we're doing it constantly but there are specific techniques that help you do this more. And one of those techniques is scripting. And I actually saw a YouTube video a year ago that helped me with this. And I remember in my mind, I said, if this works, I promise I will make everyone aware. I will tell everyone. And it was almost as if in that moment, there was a vision imprinted. And I feel like I'm living in that vision right now. It sounds crazy, I know, but it is. it seems crazy to me in my mind when I think about it, but it's, it's amazing the power we hold as humans. So here's the way you do it, okay? It's quite simple. You take a paper, you write down on this paper a letter of gratitude to yourself in the future, okay? Go do this, pause, grab a notebook. I promise you, this will be the one thing that you look back on and are like, whoa, wow, okay. I'm so happy I did that. That completely changed the course of my life. So go do it. Don't think twice, okay? So. Grab a notebook, you're gonna write a letter of gratitude to yourself in the future and write it as if you already have the things that you are trying to embody or manifest into your life. So you write down, I am grateful for X, Y, Z. I'm grateful for this. For me guys, I wrote down on my paper a year ago, I wrote down, I am so grateful to be traveling the world and have a group of supportive friends. I did not have this at the time. I also wrote down the specific amount of money that I'm not gonna reveal online, that I wanted to make online through my business. I didn't even have a business at the time. I wrote this down, I wrote down everything, and there's one condition as you're writing. There is one condition. You have to believe that what you write down is possible. This is extremely important. Because everything I wrote down, I knew it was within reach. I wasn't like, I wasn't saying like, I'm gonna make a million dollars, because instantly that's not the first step. I know that's coming, but you have to remember there's there's layers, there's levels. So you have to take it one step at a time, see what is the highest goal right now that you can achieve within your perspective that would change your life and write it down. Say, I'm grateful. Thank you, universe, God, higher power. I said all of these things. Thank you, universe, God, higher power for X, Y, Z. Thank you for the ability to travel and be free in this life and live and have supportive friends who help me and every single thing I wrote down came true. It is so crazy. I didn't have friends in business. All my friends were from like college. They weren't real friends. And as soon as I, it didn't happen instantly, but this method after that, I noticed how things started to shift because what happens is as you write down and tap into this feeling of gratitude, you are pulling this experience to you. It's coming to you instead of you just moving towards it. It is now moving towards you because you're tapping into the feeling of gratitude of already having it. The universe responds to energy, frequency, and vibration. Remember, the smartest people in the universe knew this. Albert Einstein talked about it. Nikola Tesla, hyper geniuses talked about this. So it's all about tuning into that feeling. And as you write down a letter to yourself in the future for accomplishing and achieving this life, you start to tune into that energy and that being, the frequency of that reality, and it comes to you. So I experienced this firsthand. I still had some doubt in my mind when I did it, I won't lie. And every single thing, every single thing, please do not think twice, write a letter of gratitude to yourself. I found myself traveling the last few months between Florida, Costa Rica, and other states, Colorado different places that I just wanted to go for fun. And opportunities in my life just have started to open up as I started to tune into that energy. It really is magical. We have to always remember that before anything comes into our reality, it is first a thought, a vision, anything. Even if it's subconscious, this is why most of our realities are subconscious. You see, according to neuroscience today, our lives are 93 to 95% unconscious depending on person to person, but also it depends person to person completely. The consciousness level is determined by your ability to be present in this moment, be out of the past, out of the future, into the here, the now, the present. So once you have your letter of gratitude written out, what you're going to do 
you're gonna write out in detail every single thing. I'm grateful for this, I'm grateful for that. Tap into the feeling of what it is that you're trying to achieve and attain in your life. Write it down, tap into the feeling, really soak in that feeling, that energy, because emotion is energy in motion. So tap into that emotion, that energy, and see what happens. See what happens, just observe your life. And what you're gonna do, you're gonna write it down every single day for 30 to 60 days, and then you're gonna forget about that paper. It's not gonna happen instantly. You have to let go, surrender, and detach afterwards. And I will say that tapping into that vision, that dream, the feeling of it, the energy behind it is a very big piece, but it's also not the biggest piece because most people don't have two things. They don't have a proper practice to go beyond their mind, beyond the layers inside their mind. And this is why meditation is so important. A lot of you might know already, I'm a meditation teacher and I meditate hours every day and I notice that I go beyond those thoughts in my mind. And one thing I can 100% confirm from all of the clients that I've been working with is that when you meditate and then visualize or manifest, do your manifestations in a journal, what happens is your manifestations become accelerated forward. You start to see the differences in your life. You start to see things show up in your life and it might start to feel like you're in a dream. It really does because things that you think of or were visualizing start to show up in weird spots, unexpected spots in your life. And this is truly powerful. And this is when you know, when you start to feel the synchronicities, when you start to see the signs in life, in the universe, in people, things will start to click, add up, and you'll notice and feel this feeling like it's coming, it's coming, and it will come. You just must trust, you must fall back and trust the universe. It will come, I promise. So while the letter of gratitude to yourself in the future is extremely powerful, if you want to accelerate it to the max, what you need to do is write your manifestations, write down exactly what you want as if you already have it, letter of gratitude to you, the universe. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna meditate right after soak in that vision, soak in that feeling for at least a few minutes every day. If you can just dedicate a few minutes of your day to this, give yourself to this, my friend, you will shift and transform into that reality quicker than you think, right? Because the thoughts are what limit us. We stay stuck in our mind. We stay thinking, right? We stay thinking because thoughts are the language of the mind, but feelings are the language of the body, of the physical reality in a sense. So when you're stuck up here, always thinking about what's the next step, what's the next step? Yes, you'll get there. But if you focus on the feeling, just focus on the feeling and see. That makes for a great video. Love you guys.